Hey guys, what's going on? It's Massive Joe's Raw Review and I'm coming to you from MassiveJoe's.com. Cool Raw Review today, man. One of my favorite companies on the supplement market, in the supplement industry at the moment, Muscle Farm. Big fan of Muscle Farm. Love a salt pre-workout. Love amino one intra workout. Love the s'mores combat protein powder. Oh, I need a minute to think about the s'mores. Anyway, this Raw Review, finally, on the recon, man. Finally on the recon, there's a story behind the recon, man. I actually used the recon for the first time going back uh, towards the end of last year. So, man, actually, not even earlier toward, than towards the end of last year, it was about nine months ago, I used the recon first up. Man, I thought, this is an awesome product. This is an awesome product. I've been trying to get it in ever since at a decent price, man. Could never make it happen. The price was ridiculous. That's why we didn't get it in. Now we got ourselves a good price. Got ourselves a recon, man. All right, let's get straight into it. Show you what's in it. This is nutritional information panel. Now that's a big one. There's a lot of stuff in this product, man. It's a recovery product. So break it down really simple for you. It's a recovery product supposed to take a post-workout before your post-workout protein shake. It's a carbohydrate and branch chain amino acid. Well, let's just go carbohydrate and amino acid based recovery product because there's BCAAs in there, there's essential amino acids in there. Man, in terms of the actual stuff that's in it, that's worth talking about. The carbohydrate blend is a blend of glucose polymers, dextrose and inulin, which is fiber. Then you got your branch chain aminos in there, of course. You got your L-glutamine, your taurine, your arginine in there. You got an essential amino acid complex, so all the other essential aminos are in there as well. Then you got like what they call their anti-stress matrix, which is a waste of time. You got your muscle extend matrix which has got some beta alanine some citrulline malate and some ginger extract also a waste of time post workout i'm being brutally honest with the muscle farm in this man brutally honest i ain't gonna sugarcoat it for the muscle farm for the recon got yourself some reload matrix in there which is about stabilizing blood sugar levels got a bit of chromium in there some vanadyl sulfate some fenugreek extract got yourself a muscle detoxifier this is pretty cool this is possibly the best part of this post-workout recovery product, man. The muscle detoxifier. I've got some cranberry extract, some dandelion root, some bear berry berries, some saw palmetto, and some other bits and pieces that just help with, with removing toxins from the muscle post-workout, man. Then you got some artificial colors, artificial flavors, the usual stuff that you're into seeing in these supplements, man. That's what's in it. In terms of how it tastes, how it mixes, I'm gonna be honest with the viewers at home, it doesn't mix very well, it doesn't taste very good. That's all I can say. There's too many BCAAs in it to mix well, so you get those little floaty things that go, man, it doesn't mix very well. You get floaties, you get sinkers, it just doesn't mix very well. In terms of how it tastes, it doesn't taste good. I could use an expletive in here to describe how it tastes, but I'm feeling nice today. So I'm just gonna leave it at, it doesn't taste good. Comes in three flavors. Comes in the fruit punch. Comes in the watermelon. Comes in the orange. Of those three flavors, watermelon is the least worst tasting. This one I got here, man. In my personal opinion. There's a watermelon there. Yeah, that's the watermelon. Look at that one there. All right, so let's get to what you want to know, which is how it makes you feel, man. How it makes you feel. I would say, the reason why I really liked this product when I first used it nine months ago, man, was just the fact that it, the, the impact that it has on delayed onset muscle soreness, man, pretty much completely removes it. So if you're used to, say, training legs, getting DOMS for five days, you take a recon, you're gonna get DOMS for like three days. If you train chest, you get DOMS for three days, you take the recon, you get DOMS for one day, man. It's a significant reduction in delayed onset muscle soreness and how long the DOMS last for, man. And it's really, really important. One thing that I noticed in particular was delayed onset muscle soreness in muscle groups that are indirectly trained. So for example, when you train chest, sometimes you get some DOMS in your triceps. When you train back, sometimes you get your DOMS in your biceps, which is a problem if like you train chest on Monday, you train triceps on Wednesday and your triceps are still sore. Or you train back on Wednesday, you train biceps on Friday and Friday your biceps are still sore. That's a problem, man. Take this stuff, ain't got that problem, man. Removes 
the Dom's problem. That's the most, uh, the thing you're gonna notice the most about it is the reduction in Dom's. In terms of actually how it makes you feel post-workout, I mean, if you're not used to supplementing with carbs post-workout, it's gonna make you feel fantastic. If you know anything about Massive Joe's, we always preach carbs post-workout, so you should already be taking them. So that's not gonna make that big a difference. Now, before I close the raw review off, man, Got to say a couple of things about this product that I'm disappointed about. Directing this to the product development managers at Muscle Farm. And please, I would love to see a video response if you would be so kind as to send one through. Explain to me this, Muscle Farm. Post-workout recovery product. Got your carbs, got your BCAAs, got your essential EAs, got your muscle detoxifiers and all those other beautiful things you put in here, man. Where's the creatine? Where's the creatine, Muscle Farm? Where's the creatine hydrochloride that we speak so highly of? Ain't no creatine in this product. Possibly behind carbs and protein, the most crucial element to a post-workout recovery is creatine. Ain't got no creatine in here. So I gotta add my own creatine. I don't like adding my own creatine. It would be fantastic if you would be so kind as to reformulate this bad boy, put some creatine hydrochloride in it. This is disappointing. It really is. Apart from that, good product, man. I like it. It's good for recovery. Just gotta add your own creatine. Guys, that's Massive Joe's Raw Review on the Muscle Farm Recon. And I'm coming to you from MassiveJoes.com. Stay massive.